Hey everyone, how's it going? So I've just picked up, or I've, it's arrived today, I ordered, I ordered off eBay an SD card uh, drive for the BBCB that we picked up last week. Now, the Beeb uh, didn't have any floppy disk chips in it. You know, the floppy disk controller wasn't there and uh, none of the associated chips in that part of the circuit were there either. So I was a little bit worried that this wouldn't work, but I, I contacted the seller. They were very helpful, said it would be absolutely fine. So I went ahead and ordered uh, the SD card uh, reader. It arrived today. Um, it's excellent. So it comes with the new prom program with uh, the MMFS, um, you know, uh, I can't, can't get my words out today. You know, the, 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 the software needed for the drive. That's on a, a chip, on a ROM that you just, you just pop in. I've put it into the highest priority slot. But anyway, that, that's all in there. So bearing in mind, there's no um, floppy disk controller circuitry in the beep and um, this is all working absolutely fine so you know you can just go ahead it comes with an sd card preloaded as well with a ton of software so you know if you wanted to you could just go ahead and shift break and uh, it will bring up your games menu and pretty much everything you can think of is there and you know not only is it there it, it loads it loads it you know super fast as well so chucky egg who doesn't like a bit of chucky egg um so yeah there's there's a ton of games uh preloaded onto the card um if you've got some stuff that you want to load in that isn't on the, the sd card you can get um mmb explorer on your pc um and you know you can you can add discs onto that you know the the, the mmb explorer it works uh, by looking at disk images so you know every entry on that sd card is is a virtual floppy disk basically it's an ssd image a single-sided disk image and you just add in you know the one that you want uh, and it will be there the next time around um We're not here to play Chucky Egg. I can't do that. But uh, yeah, so when you boot up, you'll see uh, Model B. Um, I think this works on a master as well, but I've got it here on a, a BBC B. This is an issue for Beeb. Um, so yeah, Model B, MMFS, Turbo. Um, and so there are a variety of commands that, that come on this on this ROM uh, that'll, that'll help you get, get moving. Um, I haven't explored everything. Really, the, the, the couple of commands that you're going to need to, to get started um, are DIN, DD drive, and uh, you know the drive command as, as we know it from, from DFS and all of those. So let me just give you an example of uh, the kind of thing I'm talking about. So DD drive as a command will show you your uh, four floppy drives, virtual drives, and it will show you the disk that's loaded into that drive. Um, you've already seen me run menu, which is is the you know that that one I ran with the shift break, um, and it brought up the menu of all the games. But you might not want that disk in that drive. You, you know, as an example, um, I've loaded in uh, Flicker Free Elite, and I've put in a I've I put in a blank disk as well in the next slot so that I can save my Elite games. So what I do, um, I change to drive zero, and then I use the DIN command, which inserts a disk into that drive. And I know that the number um, of the disk that I want is 13. Let me just check that on my handy list. Yeah, it's 13. Um, basically on the, on the PC, 
when you go into your MMB Explorer and you've got your SD card in the PC, uh, you'll be able to change what disks are in, you know, what slots. You'll be able to add disks into empty slots. So I've added the elite disk image into slot 13. So what I'm doing here is I'm inserting uh, the floppy disk on the SD card slot 13 into drive zero. Um, we can then look and see that that is in there. And if we do our DD drive again, we see that elite is now in drive zero. Before I run Elite, I also want to put a blank disk into drive one. So let's change to drive one. And then we insert the blank disk in. Now I know that I've put a blank disk image into slot 14 on the SD card. So I go ahead and load that. Should be a blank disk. I've already saved a file onto it, but it, yeah, it's, it's my blank disk. So let's DD drive that. <clears throat> and look, I've got uh, the elite game disc in drive one and i've got my elite save disc sorry the elite game disc in drive zero and my elite save disc in drive one i'm making this sound a lot more complicated than it really is you know to do this kind of thing it's those three commands that you need uh drive and din and then dd drive to show what you've got i'll put a summary of this in the uh in the video description there may be a quicker way to do that I doubt it because that seems pretty straightforward to me. Uh, but if you know a quicker way to do what I've just done, stick it in the comments. Um, there's obviously a ton more stuff that you can do with, uh, you know, the the uh, <coughs> commands that come on this chip. But uh, let's just query those quickly. Oh, sorry. Oh. You know, it's pretty familiar, isn't it? What you're seeing there is pretty similar to, to what we're used to with DFS. And uh, the disk images that I put in to the uh, MMB Explorer onto the SD card, they were DFS, you know, SSD floppy disk images. So there's a lot of compa compatib compatibility between the two. Um, you know, I'm new to the Beeb. I'm an Electron guy. I'm new to the Beeb and I'm new to uh, MMFS. So... You know, I'm not an expert on this by any means, but I just wanted to just show folks those those three commands um, if they were sort of scratching their head about how to do that, that sort of fairly simple procedure of actually loading a floppy disk into your virtual disk drives. Um, and in fact, if we go into ROMs, oh, uh, sorry, ROMs. Yeah, so you, I've only got the two in here. Your basic ROM that you'll have in uh, slot 12. And then the high priority one I've got in here is uh, the MMFS Turbo EEPROM that came with the package. So I'll put links up in the description to uh, the eBay um, uh, you know, item that I purchased. <clears throat> came super fast, really well built. Everything you need comes with it. And uh, yeah, so I, I hope this has helped. So let's just double check my disks are in the drive. Yeah, so if we change to drive zero and go ahead and load it, there we go. So uh, yeah, let's load a commander. And that's on drive one. And there we go, Commander Johns is loaded up and ready to go. So I hope this has been helpful. Um, if you've got a Beeb and you don't have anything other than your cassette deck attached, you know, if you've got no uh, floppy disk controller in there <clears throat> or you don't have a disk drive, you know, I would urge you to, to consider one of these SD card uh, readers because, you know, there's plenty of them around. They've been around for quite some time and they're tried and tested. Uh, but I know it can be a little bit um strange at first to, to new users so i just wanted to go over those couple of bits and pieces that are probably very obvious to, to most people and i apologize for that but it was something that stumped me at first i thought it'd be handy to post up 
But uh, yeah, anyway, have a good day, everyone. And uh, I'll catch you in the next video.